In 2010, the World Cup was in South Africa. The World Cup is the largest soccer tournament in the world. People from all over the globe came to watch their country play. Missionary Dennis Jans and his team used this opportunity to share the gospel with the people of South Africa. The World Cup here in South Africa is something that I don't think Americans truly understand. The atmosphere is just, um, just an opportunity that uh, is really once in a lifetime. By using that, you can kind of bring people together that otherwise might not have um, come together so easily for uh, a mission opportunity. <laughs> One way that Dennis and his team reached out to the community was through soccer camps. The camps gave the kids the opportunity to work on their soccer skills as well as hear the gospel. The kids are, are running when they see the, the, the cars drive up. The outreach team used an evangel ball as a tool to explain the gospel of Jesus Christ. Using soccer to teach children the love of God was an awesome opportunity for the Jans family. Yes, this is um, a developing country, but the, their, the poverty here can still be um, overwhelming. Dennis and his family are church planters. They have been living and serving in South Africa for over six years. The people, they don't have much but they do have a lot. There's, the, there's a sense of community, there's a sense of family that I think that we have gotten away from. No matter what age you are, no matter what country you are from, God can use you and your skill to tell people about Jesus. Even playing soccer with your friends can be a way to bring truth to people's lives. Mm -hmm.